Hello everyone and welcome to today's presentation. My name is Chris Kim and I'm a field application engineer at SD Microelectronics and I specialize in MEM sensors. So with the increasing demand of 5G technology today, 5G infrastructure is increasingly becoming a critical aspect that needs to be addressed. So we'll demonstrate to you today how we can use the 6-axis inertial measurement unit which consists of a 3-axis accelerometer and a 3-axis gyroscope in order to enable dynamic tilt detection in a 5G antenna leveling application. Here we have a wideband directional Yagi antenna which is capable of supporting 5G signals. I have the antenna attached to a rotator which can rotate 360 degrees along with the ability to adjust the tilt manually. With the directional antenna, it's often important to take into consideration the levelness of the antenna to gain maximum performance. So with the use of a 6-axis INU along with a dynamic incl inclinometer software library, we can enable tilt leveling on passive antennas such as this one. In our case, we're using in the demo an industrial INU part ISM330DACX that is included in the IKS02A1 nuclear expansion board. I have here preloaded Motion DI library example firmware, which can be readily found on our website. So the Motion DI library uses data from an accelerometer and gyroscope in order to provide estimation of position in terms of Euler, quaternion, or gravity vector. The library uses advanced algorithm techniques in order to provide optimal performance under different environmental condition. So for example, if we were to install this antenna in a moving environment, let's say on an RV, the library will be able to provide accurate uh, estimation of position as well as level of the antenna. The steps to running the Motion DI library with the 6-axis IMU is done in five simple steps. First, visit our website and search for xcubemems one Next, download and unpack the xcubemems one package. Next, drag and drop the dynamic inclinometer.bin file. And lastly, run the Unicleo GUI. We will now launch a program called Unicleo. Unicleo is a graphical user interface for the XQMEMS1 software package and the XTM32 nuclear expansion boards. When you launch the Unicleo program, you will notice several tabs here. Click on the dynamic inclinometer model, dynamic inclinometer tilt, and the rotation vector window. The dynamic inclinometer model window displays the model of the 5G antenna with the estimated orientation. The dynamic inclinometer tilt window shows the pitch and roll of the device, which can be used to automate the leveling of the device. Finally, we can view the rotation vector window, which outputs in graphical form, pitch, roll, and yaw information. Now that we have all the windows open, let's see the position change along with the tilt leveling information. Notice how as I move the antenna rotator every 20 degrees, the 6-axis INU is able to detect the changes in position and outputs 20 degree change in yaw. We can also observe some minute changes occurring in the roll and pitch of the device as a rotator spins around. Thank you for your time today to watch my demonstration. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to visit our website, www.sd.com. Thank you.